Hello students, so today our focus is about the unit of measurement of noise pollution. Yes, we are speaking about sound, whatever is audible to the human ear. So what is the unit used to measure these? Whether is it Pascal, is it decibel, is it Hertz? All of these definitely cannot be the answer. Okay, so let's focus on the year 1928, winding our clocks back in the Bell Laboratories in North America, owned by none other than Alexander Graham Bell, who is credited with the invention of telephone as well as the Bell system of units. Yes, he is the person who has been honored, the Bell has been named in and in his honor. So the answer definitely for the noise pollution measurement, the unit is decibel. Okay, it's a relative quantity, it's a relative unit because it's not an exact unit that just like mass or kilogram. All right. Now let us focus on a few aspects of the other units, the other options, especially in front of you, we have uh, Pascal. So what does it signify? It signifies force per unit area, force applied per unit area, which is nothing but pressure. And then the next one, Hertz, is nothing but the occurrence of anything with respect to unit time. And that's frequency. Okay, so that's frequency.